realize that there are opportunities for families to have a better experience at Children's um, by not having to be on site for all their appointments. And we realize that, especially for really um, new babies who are diagnosed with hearing loss, those families are most at risk. Those babies are most at risk for speech and language development um, delays. If babies can be diagnosed and treated for hearing loss by six months of age, they are more likely to develop speech and language comparable to their hearing peers. But the follow-up required can be a barrier for many families. That's why Cincinnati Children's offers telehealth, a secure video technology that lets families connect with an audiologist without leaving home. Audiologists use telehealth for two kinds of appointments, hearing aid evaluations and follow-up visits to see how the hearing aids are working. With the really young population, the fortunate thing is we don't have to have them here to be able to provide that follow-up. There's no specific testing that's done on site, and that's important because it really diminishes the amount of time that the family has to take off work. It diminishes the cost, it diminishes the amount of time they have to travel. Angela and Shelby Jordan's one-year-old son, Axel, was diagnosed at birth with both Down syndrome and hearing loss. Because they live three hours away from Cincinnati in a rural location, telehealth has made the process of getting hearing aids for Axel much easier. They've used the service for both hearing aid evaluation and for follow-up. And that's what today's appointment with Axel is. It's a follow-up to a recent hearing aid fitting. How much improvement have you observed in his hearing skills? Hey, the parent's initial reaction is, what do I have to have for this to work? The only thing families need for telehealth is a tablet, smartphone, or computer with a camera. And anything that has video capability, they can use to connect to us. Telehealth is well-suited for families in rural locations but it can work for anyone, including school personnel, who could use telehealth to help troubleshoot children's hearing aid equipment problems. Partnering with pediatricians is in the future as well. We're making this a routine part of what we do, you know, making this part of our process, making, it, making sure that we offer this to all families who come through the door who are applicable. Telehealth has been so great for our family. Axel has improved so greatly with his new hearing aid. To find out more, visit cincinnatichildrens.org audiology or cincinnatichildrens.org telehealth.